Hey, sup, sup. How you doing? Here I am again. This time I'm gonna present this beautiful, <laughs> let's say, twins DVD players. Uh, the number is Sony DVPS 7700. Right? My shaky hand. Now it's good. They're both the same and they're working fine. This one needs a little bit of lubrication, but we're gonna solve that. <laughs> Look at this, huh? Erotic. Like twin brothers. Yeah. <laughs> What's the deal with this? Uh, I wanted to make a video how can you get a cheap CD transport? So even if this is a DVD video player uh, that can play also CD videos and you see what it says, DVD, CD, video, CDs. Very good, of course. And it has 96 kilohertz, 24 bits, DA converter. That's also a good thing, very good thing. Uh, which means that audio from this device is also very good. Uh, Sony didn't disappoint this time. So, but we, I am making video about this DVD player as a CD transport, because if you already have a DA converter and you only need a CD transport to play your CDs, and that CD transfer will transfer music digitally with digital coaxial or optical cable to your DA converter, then you can use yours. But this one has, as I said, 10-bit video DA converter and also audio converter. <laughs> I never use it as a DVD because I bought it because I liked transport. Why two? Well, this one is a little bit cosmetically... Uh, let's say used uh, but on the other hand i think the display is brighter on that one than on this one so i'm gonna make probably some kind of combination i'm gonna probably uh, maybe use a face plate of this to put on that and sell, sell the other one for cheaper who knows anyway because i have to i'm gonna use the moment so we can demonstrate the back of this device yeah, look at that. Now we have it from the front <laughs> and from the back. So as I said, because this is a DVD player, we will have a component video out, uh, which is probably never, nobody's using it right now. If you have HDMI, but this unit doesn't have HDMI. So this is the thing. If you want your video out, you have to use it. But this is more interesting to me. Uh, you have two line outs, of course, with the video, but we don't care for video as we don't have care for S video. We only care for audio section of this thing. Um, so we have two outputs, which means that you can connect your CD uh, directly to your CASA deck and the other one to your amplifier or something whatever you choose uh, the other thing is you have a digital optical and coaxial outputs and s link probably to connect it with other sony components as it would be normal this is made in japan component and as you can see it's kind of <laughs> coppery it looks like a copper it doesn't look like aluminum or something. So yeah, uh, it's a very good and convenient thing to have those two. If you have a good CD transport, you have your digital output, you can connect it to your uh, DA converter of choice. But anyway, the sound of this converter is already good. So you don't have to. If you just want to use it as a regular CD player, it's great thing. And what is interesting, like 
when you're playing like a track and if you turn it off when you turn it on it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna continue where you when you stopped it's not gonna start from the stop you see <laughs> So if you're listening some session, some album, and you wanna turn it off, go to sleep, tomorrow you can continue. <laughs> I don't know, it's kinda cool. And of course, sexy doors opening and closing. I don't have remote control, but I don't need it. Uh, I did try to play DVDs. I mean, it's a great DVD player, of course, but all I was using is this next and previous. Uh, this needs a little bit of lubrication. I mean, I changed the belt because the tray was not coming out and in. It was stopping and everything. Now it's all good. But I didn't l lubricate it yet. <clears throat> it needs some lubrication. You can hear it a little bit. It's, you know, like a, a weird sound when, you, when it's skipping and stuff. But only when it's doing, you know skipping and stuff like that otherwise it's playing just fine so since we are here and i did all this and i got the cover unscrewed maybe we should take a look look how it looks inside we know how it looks front we know the back let's see how it looks inside hmm? turn the music off no, no, put the music back. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, okay. I don't know if you're gonna hear me. And it's gonna be copyright. Who cares for copyright? Yes, that's right. So let's see. All this looks like a copper. There is only silver that you can see is this. And it's covering probably the main board because all the cables are coming in. This, 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 this. This is the section for the video connection output. This is probably some amps. I mean, to get inside, you have to unscrew a lot of screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two at the bottom. Then you take this cover, flip it on the other side. Then you can uh try to pull the you know cd mechanism and then after you remove the tray and everything you can change the belt uh, but i didn't have time to uh, lubricate just i want to say put a little bit of <laughs> grease on it not so much or grease but it's kind of sexy i don't know maybe this side is left for some there there is another model even more even better than this one so maybe this part of the unit is for some other board but this is really good it's very neat i like this you know boards one we have one we got two we got three we got four board you know like usually when you open CD players from Sony, it's like a, some transport and a little bit of some electronics here and that's it. Some small traffic, but this is, this is something better. <laughs> and it's so heavy. So why I'm making video, as I said, you can get this on eBay or other websites, a Reverb, I don't know, Mercury. You can get it for like a 75 to 100 bucks in good condition. So if you need a good CD transport, I'm not talking about DVD because you probably already have, uh, who needs DVD today? <laughs> uh, I think I have some, but <laughs> I never play DVDs. I was already, DVX fan, like, uh, you know, torrent sites and stuff like that. But this is like a gr great unit. If you need it, like a, if you need a great CD transport, this is really great unit. 
and it's you know cheap this one is looking good i think this one will be for my collection i'm gonna pair it with a sunny dad and they're gonna be good brothers or brother and sister maybe the sunny dad is sister and this is the brother who knows take care until next time